On the scene, on the story, News on 6 starts now. And first at 9 o'clock, a car dealership in East Tulsa says someone took a crowbar to nearly every car in their inventory. They caught the vandal on camera and only on News on 6. Annie Chang has the video. She's live on the scene now with more. Annie? Craig and Terry, the family that owns this dealership, tells me that they think someone might have been trying to get revenge on them after they had to repossess his car. Surveillance cameras at Mishawakon Auto Sales show a man approaching this old white Mustang just after midnight early Sunday morning. He gets in and out of the car a few times. Then, with crowbar in hand, he tries to break into the building. No luck there. About three hours later, he starts his rampage, walking down the row of used cars for sale, smashing the windows out of each one. He doesn't try to miss any car. He goes for all of them. Jennifer Maldonado and her siblings all work at the dealership. Their dad, Domingo, is the owner, so the entire family depends on these sales. Well, it's devastating because we put in all our hard work into this business, and to just watch someone come in and be careless for what is going on. This is where we make all our money from. The vandal hit 28 cars on the lot, and the family tells me most of them aren't insured, so they'll have to pay several thousands of dollars to get them fixed. The Maldonados think this might be an act of revenge. The Mustang is a repo, they explain, and the vandalism might be a way of getting back at the dealership for repossessing the car. The family did file a police report, but it doesn't help much with peace of mind. It's safety issues that we have now with the property. We don't feel safe here. We don't know what else to do. The dealership is offering a $1,000 reward for information leading to an arrest. If you know anything about this case, call Crime Stoppers or Tulsa Police. Reporting live on the scene on the story in East Tulsa, I'm Annie Chang, News on 6.